to your exhibition and to Art Partners Australia at 488 David Street in Albury. We have a range of your works and we're very fortunate to be representing you with probably about eight or 900 of your works. We move into the latest uh, series here, the Beechworth series. Would you like to tell us a bit about these works? Yeah, these uh, works were inspired uh, by, a, by a place near Beechworth where you go for a big walk and you have real access to the boulders and the, um, the forest there. And I was struck by these, um, just by this really orangey um, pine mark and uh, just the mosses. And the whole environment's just a real stimulating environment. Um, so I, I've always got a changing show at my, in my own house. Yes. So that, um, Whenever I'm painting, I get to see, and I love having the nature in the house. Yeah, yeah drawing yeah, it in, yeah, 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 living yeah. in both yeah. parts. Yeah. Robert, here we are on the second part of the Beechworth series, and once again, the colours are just magnificent. You've really captured them more like a photograph than a painting. Yeah, but it, it's with um, painting nature, it's very challenging because it's all the detail, and to sort of try and get um, some sort of balance between realism and um, atmosphere and rhythm and distortion is I, I sort of enjoy going in and out of those playing with nature. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you explain a bit more uh, in detail what you mean by that? Yes, I, I mean sort of to um, paint something from nature you can go into hardcore realism, which you know you can do, or you can sort of veer off and go into rhythm shapes or distortion like look at Van Gogh I mean he just took it to a whole another level uh, yeah yeah and that's that's more expression so there's so many possibilities with painting you know it's limitless. so Robert here we are in the same exhibition space gallery one and we've looked at the Beechworth series now we move into uh, an amazing part of your work the Iris series. The sheer joy of painting irises is amazing because the petals, the exuberance, the shapes of them, um, the, the sort of weirdness of their structure, just a delight to paint. Yeah, with these uh, giant petals, uh, the, the tone that it uh, makes you uh, have to paint, each subject makes you paint differently and makes you paint in a in a new way, so that's why I like the changing subjects all the time because then you learn different ways of painting. 